right, I've ripped the chips away from Linda and we're back. Now we're up to your favourite part. Sweet time. What are we having? Your favourite Kit Kat. Kit Kat. Not the biggest fan of Kit Kat. New Kit Kat. Inspired by Milk Choc Chunk Cookie. Say that five times fast. Inspired by the Byron Bay Company's Milk Byron Choc cookies. Chunk Cookie. What's that? Say that again? Faster? The Byron Bay Company Milk Choc Chunk Cookie. Again, like really fast. <laughs> the Byron Bay Milk Choc Chunk Cookie. <laughs> Uh, peel open, share, and reclose. What, like it sticks back together? Yep. You don't need that. You eat the whole thing. Hey? <laughs> know your portions. One row equals one serve. Did you get that? No one listens one, to that. One row is one serve. Serving size, 15.5 grams is one one row servings per package 11 there's 11 it should last you 11 sessions does it ever last you 11 sessions? yeah the one session is one minute <laughs> 11 minutes that's right ingredients sugar milk solids vegetable fat wheat flour cocoa butter cocoa mass cocoa choc paste choc cookie crumb Emulsifiers, glucose syrup, raising agent, salt, yeast, processing, aid. Flavour. What does that mean when they say flavour? <laughs> Contains milk, wheat, gluten, soy. They contain tree nuts, other gluten containing ingredients. Alright, where is it made? Make it obvious. I'm hoping in Australia because it's got the Byron Bay choc chunk. What will actually say though? You'd think it would say, right? Am I like hallucinating? Yes. It is almost one o'clock. <laughs> Where does it say that? <laughs> At the end of the video. Made in Australia. Very close up thing and you can have a look. Made in Australia, right down the bottom. Oh, right there. Tiny bit down the bottom. Sorry, it's 1am. It's getting a bit late. It took you a while to pull me away from the chips. <laughs> Alright, what am I expecting? I expect it to taste like the Kit Kat, but a bit sweeter because anything that's usually cookie related is like extra sweet, I find anyway. Um, a bit wafery, like a Kit Kat taste, if that's what I can remember. Don't expect too much. I'm expecting maybe a five out of 10, but we'll see. Gee, she's gone early with that rating. How do we peel open and reclose? It's getting too late, my brain doesn't work now. Uh oh, this is like the first thing that I haven't been able to open. Yep, I got it. Jeez, that, that's a 10 star open. Because it sticks and then what, you can reclose it? Yeah. I don't know that I would trust that seal. That's not reclosed. Come on. No way. Oh, look, and then you can just. It's so easy. I don't trust your reseal, man. Probably just need to eat all 11 rows just in case, right? Okay. They look like what I would expect. Same as the picture, really, right? Picture. Actual chocolate. How many serves? One row. Just okay. one row. Eat one row. Can't break it. <laughs> Oh. I don't know if it's because it's been a long time since I ate a Kit Kat, but is it always that thick on the outside? I feel like it's like thicker.
eat one and tell me if it's quicker. Pretty much the same as a normal Kit Kat in terms of thickness. Oh, that's sweet. Would you like a glass of milk? Well, it's too late to get one. Focusing at all. <coughs> no, nah, don't like it. Do you try. Irritating my throat now. <coughs> I'm going to give this a four out of ten. I don't like this. I'm going back to the chips. Well, I don't want you to buy it again. Not for me. Maybe for you. Sorry, Byron Bay, we're from Adelaide. Let's say four. Ooh, you better cut the film because I feel like downgrading. Oh. No, too sweet. Don't like it. Three. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs>